Good Thursday morning, everybody. Chris Allen with your weather podcast for this May 19th. We're starting out with some areas of patchy, dense fog this morning and a cool start with temperatures across the Kentucky Mesonet Network in the upper 40s, some mid-40s this morning, so you may need a jacket or a sweater as you head out this morning. But later today, finally, some sunshine And we're going to warm things up. It looks like uh, maybe in the low 70s before the day is done. Looking back at our Tuesday, no, Wednesday. That was yesterday, right? Yeah, today's Thursday, right? Okay, 65 was our high temperature at the Bowling Green Airport around 345 yesterday afternoon. 78 is where we should be on average, so we were 13 degrees below average Once again, 8 degrees below average on our low temperature, which was 48, when we should be averaging 56. 80 was our high a year ago today. 64 was our low back in 2015. And yesterday morning, we picked up an additional 36 hundredths of an inch of rain at the Bowling Green Airport. Now for the month of May, we're at 3.10. That puts us only a quarter inch behind for the month of May. And year to date, we're now over the 15-inch mark. We should be closer to 19. So we're still about 4, 4.6, uh, 4.64, doing the math here, 4.64 inches below average. So we're, you know, we're better than we were. And uh, now we can get by maybe a little while without rain again but as i look at the forecast uh, (laughs) even though today is going to be nice friday not so much for today after the morning fog dissipates we'll see a mostly sunny warmer day as high pressure takes over and we'll see a high of 73 that should feel a little bit better still below average but better than it's been the last few days Tonight, though, look for increasing clouds, and sometime after midnight, early Friday morning, showers will begin to move in from our south. We'll see a low tonight at 56, and for Friday, a 100% chance of rain. Not really looking for thunderstorms, just a general steady rain all day. With a high of 68, some locations could get an inch or more of rain out of this, especially along and east of I-65 and along the uh, Cumberland Parkway and the Cumberland Plateau down toward Dale Hoddle Lake, Lake Cumberland. That's where the most rain appears that it will fall during the day tomorrow. I know, right now we <clears throat> we basically have caught up on rain or come close to it. We really don't need any more. But the good news is, once we get past the rain on Friday, we are going to go through a bit of a dry period for a while. Saturday, we've taken out much of the chance of rain, so Saturday's looking even better now than it did just yesterday. Mix of sun and clouds and a high of 73. Uh, Maybe some very early morning showers Saturday morning, but most of that will be gone. 77 and sunny for Sunday. Monday, sunshine and around 80. Now, temperature is getting back to where they should be this time of the year. Tuesday into Wednesday, another system moving in with a chance of a shower or thunderstorm late day Tuesday after a high of 84. And then Wednesday, a chance of a scattered shower or thunderstorm and a high at 83. But uh, today, enjoy it. Just watch out for the patchy, dense fog this morning. And then look for a lot of rain again on Friday. All right, that'll do it for this edition of the podcast. God bless as always, and thank you so much for listening. Know the weather before it knows you. Have a great day. I'll see you live at 5.30 on AM Kentucky, 11 a.m. on midday. Streaming live to the WBKO app and WBKO.com. Then later today, join me for my radio show at Classic Hits, Sam 100.7. Special show today because tonight at Sky Pack at 7.30, the Little River Band will be live in concert, and I'll be broadcasting the final hour of my show from 6 to 7 from Sky Pack, giving away some Sam swag. We'll 
maybe have some T-shirts and koozies and all kinds of cool stuff to give away. Uh, if you're coming to the concert, come early, get your seat. It's going to be packed, it appears. And um, then I'll get to uh, bring the Little River Band on stage tonight, starting at 7.30 for the big concert, 40 years of LRB. It's going to be quite uh, a good night. All right, that'll do it. Have a great day, and I'll see you later.